Hello! Oh my goodness, there's so much stuff that's happened. I haven't done a video in a couple of days. Okay, uh, where to begin? Mercury is no longer retrograde. We're still in the shadow period. Um, I think let's focus on that for this video. We'll focus on other stuff in the future, a couple of days. Um, with Mercury going direct, but it's still in its shadow period, and it's, it's conjunct Mars, which is now in Scorpio, I think the most viable thing we could do during this time is to focus on... What we've learned over this last these last three weeks about ourselves, about our emotions, about what we need, um, what we desire, um, learning the difference between need and want has been a big focus for November, and focusing on how to now put those revelations, those insights into practice. Now is a great time to be able to start getting stuff done with Mars being in Scorpio, with it being conjunct Mercury. Whatever we focus on, we're going to actively and aggressively, well, maybe not aggressively, energetically. Aggressively is the shadow part of all this. We want to actually avoid that. We don't want to waste our energy in pointless conflict with other people. That's not what this any time is about, but especially not this time. This time is more about mastering ourselves and pushing forward with clear-minded, like laser focus. And over the next couple of weeks, and really, I mean, over the next six weeks with Mars being in, in Scorpio, but especially, I would say, over the next three weeks or so, through to a month, something like that, but more so on the next three weeks, we're really going to be able to move ahead with a very clear-minded focus if we choose to do so. And again, some people are going to be very argumentative, very negative, very... They'll not have... <sighs> And it's never good to be condescending or look down on anybody. Um, but it's good to know that people who are overly argumentative during this time have not done the work necessary through the last couple of weeks with the retrograde period of going inward and understanding more about themselves, understanding more about, again, what they need, what they want, the difference between need and want, um, how to healthily express their themselves and their own particular power in life. And so if they're stifled, if they're angry, or if you're feeling that, you know, again, it's good to not focus too much on other people, as always, especially during this time. We don't want to project. But whoever's angry and really just wants to have an argument really needs to focus more on, okay, what are my priorities? Am I satisfying my needs? Am I fulfilling myself? Am I moving forward? Is my passion being used? Am I, am I growing and transforming myself because I'm going into the the scary spaces of experience. I've never done this before, and it's scary, but I know I need to do it, so I'm going to do it. If we do that, this is an amazing time. We're able to transform incredibly. We're able to shift. I, I see a lot of people going through some really extreme emotional things, um, and have been over the last uh, this last month, but also you know over the last several months, last years potentially, turning around dramatically. Uh, from addiction or whatever else. So that's really beautiful. We all have this potential. It doesn't matter. It, it, we don't have to have been going through some really negative things to make this into a really positive time, is my point. So focus on that. That's great. There's so much other stuff to focus on, but I want to keep this short. Um, Venus and Jupiter are conjunct Sagittarius. Have fun with friends. Have fun enjoying yourself. Um, it's good to be generous at, during this time, as long as you're responsibly generous. Sun is about to go into Sagittarius. So we'll cover that. Um, last thing, Moon is in Libra as of today and tomorrow. Um, the focus is on communication, cooperation. Make sure you stand up for yourself, but also make sure, again, you're not being too aggressive. We don't want to be aggressive. Energetic, sure. If we feel angrier, okay, we'll express it. But we still want to be able to work with others and understand where others are coming from. That's very important during this time. All right, cool. As always, infinite love to you, my friends. And as always, I'm doing readings. Namaste. As always, I'm doing readings, so feel free to get in contact with me uh, through my email, uh, williamharrison at live.com. All the info is in the about section of this YouTube video, or if you're watching this on Instagram, in the bio link, whatever. All right, peace.